Stories play an important role in speeches as they provide real life examples and help to hold the listener's attention. Obama often concludes his speeches with a story that encapsulates his entire message. Consider the following example. Now tomorrow I'll travel to Las Vegas and meet with some of these students, including a young woman named Astrid Silva. Astrid was brought to America when she was four years old. Her only possessions were a cross, her doll, and the frilly dress she had on. When she started school, she didn't speak any English. She caught up to other kids by reading newspapers and watching PBS. And she became a good student. Her father worked in landscaping. Her mom cleaned other people's homes. They wouldn't let Astrid apply to a technology magnet school, not because they didn't love her, but because they were afraid the paperwork would out her as an undocumented immigrant. So she applied behind their back and got in. Still, she mostly lived in the shadows. Until her grandmother, who visited every year from Mexico, passed away. And she couldn't travel to the funeral without risk of being found out and deported. It was around that time she decided to begin advocating for herself and others like her. And today, Astrid Silva is a college student working on her third degree. Are we a nation that kicks out a striving, hopeful immigrant like Astrid? Or are we a nation that finds a way to welcome her in?